Hey everyone, this is Friedel Halkar, AJ Raven, and I'm here with my reaction review of Sex Education season number three, episode number eight, which is the season three finale. And I enjoyed certain moments uh, in this series, in this season. And uh, however, there were also certain moments that I wanted to fan off. Now, of course, I'll be focusing more on the Adam Eric mess uh, that occurred uh, throughout this season, which I mean. The writers ended up making Eric cheat on Adam when he was off uh, in Nigeria to attend a wedding and he ended up kissing another dude, which makes no sense. And then Eric ended up telling Adam about it and I'm like, Eric, why would you tell such a thing to Adam? Like, it's weird. And the writers are, for some reason, making Adam and Raheem friends or something. And the way they ended up doing that with having uh, Raheem have an accident when they were uh, in in the school bus and uh, Adam standing up for him it felt so weird like you couldn't you couldn't figure out another way to have uh, Raheem and Adam be friends or something but anyway I'll talk more about it uh, later but yeah episode number eight is here I really hope that Otis's mom survives but let's see what happens oh so we are opening the episode with that character like this character is uh, non-binary with another with, uh, along with another character named cal mm. that was horrible yeah otis had a fight with his mom the last time they spoke because yeah his mom was trying to understand what's happening with Maeve. frankly i like Maeve more with isaac but let's see where this narrative goes yeah, Adam hasn't replied to Eric because Eric was like, I need to talk to you. So maybe now Adam will reply or something. Yeah, these two need to talk. Like, I'm not a fan of your relationship, but they still need to talk. Yeah, they're like, yep, we'll talk. There's someone else in Nigeria. Like, why? I told Adam. Why? I wanted to tell you too, but I just, I was so ashamed and I didn't know how to. You wanted to be here, I don't know. I feel like a bad person, I don't even know why I did it. Because the script told you to. It made me feel free. Okay. And so a bad person. Liked it? Tell me she's alive. Is my mum okay? Yeah. It's too early to say. Adams found out that oh, he's I into dog training, What's which, this? okay, no, whatever uh, makes you happy. I'm competing with Madam tonight. I just think that you would want to come. Mm. Of course I want to be there. Is your friend Eric coming? <laughs> uh, yeah, no. he's, he's not out to this mind. Oh. Sorry to hear that. About oh, Eric, Eric being a boyfriend. People like to be asked to go to things. Makes them feel like you care. Mm. I'm interested in seeing what kind of conversation Adam and Eric are going to have because Eric was like, I kissed a dude in Nigeria and I liked it. Yeah. I'm going to see actually come back here. How are you? Uh, Eric kissed someone else. You're probably happy to hear that. I'm actually not. Are Eric going to make these two a thing? I hope not. Yeah, so shit. I hate him, which is annoying because I also love him. I know that feeling now. <laughs> What's this? I'm competing in a thing where tiny dogs jump through hoops and shit. It's really stupid, though. Charming. <laughs> Are the writers going to make Adam and uh, Raheem a thing? Like, come on now. Because I'm not a girl, and mm -hmm. I'm worried you still see me as one. Yeah. That's, yeah, maybe I do. that's something they need to figure out. Um, Especially, he world. needs to figure that out. Here's the thing. I'm still figuring out so much shit about myself. I can't carry into. And I still want to have fun when I can. Mm -hmm. Because I feel so heavy all the time. So, what is this? Yeah. It means that we can still be friends. <laughs> I don't really have friends out there like that. There's a first for everything. Yeah. This is what I wanted Eric and Adam's relationship to be. Eric being I like, really like you. Eric 
like Ari being like Adam, you and I are on different pages. I really like you too. Different chapters in our journey. We can be friends Sorry. and work things out, but this there was yeah, there was no reason for Eric and Adam to be a couple, a romantic couple, and Eric leaving Raheem for Adam. Like, be mature about it, the way these two are. Yeah, she needs to get back into loving aliens. I understand why she felt that she needed to let her go and grow and mature or whatnot, but she needs to get back into it. It makes her happy. Hi, Mom. Change my mind. Yeah, good for her. I have been sent to tell you personally. What? Because a sixth form is, this decision could have a dire effect on your futures. You will need to find educational alternatives to complete your schooling by the end of this term. Oh, so it's closing down. Basically, you guys are fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, mm -hmm. I was wondering if you'd read my poem. The one you wrote for Eric? I want to give it to Eric, but I think it's still shit. Okay, I read it for you. Yeah, I don't want this to be a thing. I really don't. Like, yeah. Raheem like uh, getting to date the ex-boyfriend of his own ex-boyfriend who was also his ex-boyfriend's ex-bully. I'm so sorry. Like, no. Apologizing. Can we walk out here? Yeah, they need to talk. Adam's hurt? to certain viewers that's how he comes across right now like now he's realizing all of this he knew what he was getting into when he ended up like becoming a couple with Adam oh. Oh. yeah of course understandable reaction I think at this point Eric doesn't even know what he wants he, he was with Raheem who was proud and out Eric didn't want that he was with uh, Adam, who was a work in progress. Eric didn't want that. <sighs> the paternity desk. The writer's torment just messed us up. Come on. So what? It's not J uh, Jacob's daughter? <laughs> Boy, I don't like talking to Rush in the heart. Mm-hmm. 
Raheem reading Adam's uh, poem. I didn't know what that meant because. I didn't know what that meant because. Like, I'm talking over this because of the song and I don't want to get copyrighted. I had a heart until you said you kissed the boy. Uh huh. Then I knew I had a heart. Okay. So it's basically writing from the heart. And when I thought my heart might stop beating, mm -hmm. I realized that it had always been there. <laughs> Yeah, her in her own I fantasy with her boyfriend. I knew we wouldn't last forever. Uh huh. I was waiting for this day. Oh. But I hope we can fix things. Okay. And if we can't, I will always thank you for showing me I have a heart. Okay. Okay. So that was the poem. Yeah, I really, I really, I really don't want them to be a thing, Adam and Raheem. Come on, no, no. Yeah, I really like Isaac and Maeve together, compared to Otis and Maeve. As friends, maybe? Maybe. Probably. Mm. Let's give some time. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Yes, to these two getting back together, but they need to talk more. Yeah. Is that Eric? Uh, no, it's a friend. Mm -hmm. Um, Eric wasn't my friend anymore. Oh, he's coming out. He was my boyfriend. He's coming out. Yeah, Adam. We broke up. Oh, yeah. Adam doesn't need a boyfriend right now, in my opinion. Uh, like, Adam needs more queer friends. Not necessarily. Oh, oh, okay. Why? Why? He'll be disappointed. Just be disappointed. Yeah, yeah. He needs to talk to his dad. I go with uh, Adam. We break up. Bro, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> so bad? No. Let's finish this free house. Yeah, yes. he's like, I need to, I need to keep moving How forward. Is this? How is this goodbye? Yeah. No. Oh, okay, if you say so, mate. Let's see you soon. If you say so. But then again, you have to remember that these are like, what, 17, 18 year old kids? Like, they have decades to figure out who they want to be with. Okay. Wish me luck. Come on, Eric. Bye. Also, does it mean that Maeve is being written out? That she won't return for season number four? Or maybe she'll return during the finale? I guess. I also kind of like Otis and Ruby. Like, Ruby was like really, really in love with Otis. So let's see where that leads. If the writers decide to make that a thing again. So that was Sex Education season number three. I might end up writing my opinions down for the Geek Curie in a written article. If I do, the link to that will be down in the comment section below. If I don't, then it is what it is. Like, like I said, I kind of enjoyed this season, but not as much. Yeah, there were some, some moments where I thought like the narrative was dragging. Uh, the whole hoax storyline made no sense. The writers tried to make her sympathetic, but then again, the backstory they gave her wasn't the most original. I was expecting more, but as I said, yeah, it is what it is. Anyway, coming back to Eric, Adam, and Raheem, like, I guess the writers will be continued with that weird triangle, which, yeah, I'm, I'm not really sure how I feel about it. Like, Adam and Raheem kind of being friends, I understand that at this point of time, but Adam and Raheem may be in boyfriends, like, please don't, writers, please don't. As far as Eric is concerned, as I said before, I really don't know. Yeah, I'm, I think that Eric isn't sure about what he wants. So I guess he has a whole lot of discovering to do as well. But yeah, feel free to leave your thoughts down in the comment section below. And until next time, stay happy, stay safe, stay blessed. See you guys later.